When people are transitioning from gym training where they sit in a machine and they push, they're very linear. They're very good at moving heavy weights in straight lines. Most sports involve rotation. So we need to find breakdown drills to force people to be better at rotation. Hello, this is Mark Wildman of Wildman Athletica. And today we are going to talk about a full kneeling back position swing with a heavy club. This exercise is designed to help people learn how to rotate their spine and their shoulders to improve throwing patterns. Throwing is one of the things that separates humans from everything else on the planet. We hold on to levers, we throw them. Think about throwing a baseball, throwing a football. In a historical context, think about throwing a tomahawk, think about throwing a javelin. This separates us from everything else on the planet. There are a lot of very strong, very fast animals out there, but there is only one animal that has thumbs that can hold on to levers and use those levers to either throw things or build civilization. Because we live in the modern world, we sit down all the time and we are on screens a lot. People are becoming more and more rounded. They're having a harder time learning to extend their shoulder and get their thumb all the way down to the back of their shirt. The exercise you should definitely put into your training if you do no other leverage-based exercise is the two-handed heavy club shield cast. When we think about the two-handed heavy club shield cast, we think top hand goes past opposite ear. This is a shielding movement that you associate with every form of two hands on one sword. A shielding movement into an attacking movement. This is the base pattern of throwing. When we take away the bottom hand, it turns into a single side shield cast. When we add it to a circle and move it past the same side ear, it becomes your basic inside throwing pattern. If we were to change directions, it would become our outside basic throwing pattern. There are both inside and outside throwing patterns. When we do a shield cast, either two-handed or single-handed, the important limiting factor is people getting their thumb all the way down to the nape of their neck. Think about the collar of your shirt and the way that they rotate their hips. A shield cast is not a shoulder exercise. It is a total body exercise involving your wrist, your elbow, your shoulder joint, every joint in your spine, your hips rotating from side to side, your knees and your ankles. We do breakdown exercises where we focus on putting the club behind the head and just swinging from side to side and getting the thumb all the way down and learning to time the rotation of our body with the swinging weight. We use a bunch of drills to improve that thumb back position and work on rotation. The standing back position side to side swing, the half kneeling back position side to side swing, and then the full kneeling back position side to side swing. That is the exercise we are going to work on right now. It is the last in the series of drills to help people get better at the shield cast. Pick up the club first, step up to the club, club directly between the insteps of the feet, stack two hands on top of each other, pick the club up to our order position. From here, step back with one leg, find the ground. This is called half kneeling position. Two knees all the way on the ground, full kneeling position high. We also have a low full kneeling position, but that one gets even harder. High full kneeling position. Put the club all the way back behind your head. Take the top hand thumb and touch it to the nape of the neck. The cues are rotate 45 degrees, rotate swing, rotate swing, rotate swing, rotate swing, back and forth. We are taking the ankles and the knees out of the equation and we are working on just rotating the hips and the spine. The spine is a giant series of joints and every single one of them should rotate in conjunction with both your hip and your shoulder. Thumb all the way down to shirt, rotate 45, rotate 90 degrees, which is 45 the other direction. Over time, start to add in this tricep Extension, thumb touch, drive, thumb touch, drive, thumb touch, drive, thumb touch, drive, thumb touch, drive. Every time we change our foot or our knee or our hip position, we can consider that a different drill. 
They can get more specific to sport over time, but the goal is to get our basic general physical preparedness, throwing and rotating pattern, better, better movement, better structure, better breathing, and to go up in weight and eventually increase the length of the lever over time. We use clubs because they allow us to get down into the half kneeling and the kneeling position without crushing our feet or our ankles. It is different than a mace. You can also use maces for standing exercises, but with these half kneeling exercises, in the beginning, it works better to use a heavy club. We always start with a lightweight and work our way up over time. Most people rotate one direction well and one direction very, very poorly. So these exercises are meant to help you figure out what direction you don't rotate well so you can figure out what you need to work on and then put it back into your general physical preparedness two-hand heavy shield cast.